What's good, YouTube? You know who it is. Chris Jones, representing Physics of Greatness. Right now, I'm on the road, man, getting ready to head to Dallas real quick and see my people. But uh, I just got done working out with Kelly Burke and Raymond Walker. I will have the video up sometime tomorrow. Um, a lot of y'all are wondering why I decided to train at Metro Flex in Arlington. Well, I'm trying to make this next bulk right here count. So I'm trying to get as intense as possible. Lately, I've been training like a bitch. I haven't been going beast mode. I've been kind of going bitch mode. So I'm trying to go to Metro Flex at least twice a week and meet up with Kelly and Raymond. Uh, if you happen to be interested, check out the channels. I got the channels in the description. Real cool, guys. Now, this was chest day. I'm going to show you exactly why right here. Why these guys are taking me to the next level, man. After training with these guys, I realized I got a long way to go before I reach my potential. I'm going to show you a few clips right now. Hey, baby. Hey, wait. Stop nothing, baby. I'm going to pee that, man. You got me, man. I know Kelly got me, man. If you know anything about me, guys, you know that usually I go about 245, maybe... 265 but since I'm bulking it's very important to try to get stronger man and also force reps is a good way to get stronger as well it's a good way to beat those muscles down you can't do force reps without a good partner you can trust as you see Kelly got to my back man with 275 now a lot of you probably think that's not heavy but for me, that's heavy. I've always trained for the pump, man. I always train what's comfortable for me. You know what I mean? So I'm really, really curious to see how the next five months of training hard and heavy is going to do for my physique. As you see, Raymond and Kelly is throwing this shit up like it's nothing. And it shows in their physique. Yes, sir. Again, 315 on a bench. I've never tried 315 on a bench in my life. I only got it like one and a half, but it felt damn good to face those fears. It felt damn good to get this on camera for the first time in my life. Now watch Kelly and Raven do this shit. You gotta train with beast if you want to be a beast, man. You gotta, like the Indians used to say, you gotta stay close to the fire if you want to get warm, man. I can't agree with that enough. I am so motivated. I can't wait to go to the gym and train chest again. Look at the way they throw on that 315. It's like nothing for them. Raymond did that shit like five clean reps. Here we go. Lightweight. Now, a lot of you may not know this, but dumbbell presses is one of the best ways to get a fully developed chest. That's because you bring the humerus up and across. The contraction is like unmatched. However, I don't like dumbbell presses. They have this machine in Metroflex. And other reason why I joined this gym, see, it makes your arms work independently. That way you don't have no muscle imbalances and it feels natural. So again, I can't wait to see how five months of using this machine is going to do for my chest. Stay tuned for the whole chest routine. I'll try to have it up tomorrow, guys. See, guys, these guys are really pushing me to the max, man. I'm moving weight. I would have never tried to move alone. As you may or may not know, yes, bodybuilding is about the pump. It's about keeping the muscles under tension and all that good stuff but quite frankly if you're hitting the bench press for 225 and then a year later you're still doing reps with 225 you're not gonna make much gains you have to get stronger too even though strength is not the number one goal should be but you still gotta do reps with more weight if you wanna see gains these guys are pushing me 
Like I said, I have a video up tomorrow. Be looking out for it. Don't forget to like my shit. Comment, subscribe, and hold back at you, boy. And if you don't subscribe to POG, fuck your motherfucking self, man. Chris Jones. Yeah. Chris Jones. Chris Jones.